depression for me is um, when you don't feel like doing anything, um, when you don't want to be alone, want to be with someone, otherwise when you're alone you feel sad, um, you don't want to get up in the morning, you don't feel like doing anything, um, you kind of just want to lay around everywhere. Um, that's what depression is to me. What made me depressed was when I lost my mom. Uh, I lost my mom due to cancer uh, when I was 18. Everything, I mean, I just felt like I was at the bottom, at the very bottom of what I could possibly get because she was who I depended on. I felt empty, I felt sad. I just felt like the world was ending for me. What made me depressed was when I lost my mom. Uh, I lost my mom due to cancer uh, when I was 18. Everything, I mean, I just felt like I was at the bottom, at the very bottom of what I could possibly get because she was who I depended on. I felt empty, I felt sad. I just felt like the world was ending for me. I mean, I honestly didn't think I would ever feel better from, from from that. I used to cry myself to sleep all the time when I was going through that. Um, it was, I would, all I wanted to do was sleep and because I, I had this void, I attempted to fill the void through a marriage. Um, I got married very young, just a year later after my mom passed away and that only brought on more problems. We used to fight all the time, it wasn't just verbally, a lot of the times it was physical. It got to the point where when we used to live at our apartment complex, um, several times, not just once, the police would show up thinking there was abuse going on um, because of how loud the bangs were, the screaming, um, and the neighbors would report it. So it, that wasn't just once, it was several times. After we had a fight, all I would do was cry. Um, I didn't know what there was to do. Um, all I knew, my only method was to cry and to wait for Thursday night to come around um, when the clubs were open and I would go to clubs, I would drink. It wasn't just one or two, it was four, five, six, whatever it took at the time so that I would feel better. I would drink anything they would give me to drink, really. And then I would start doing that from Thursday, I would do that Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then Monday would come around and I would have to wait all over again until Thursday came around so that, that I could start doing that all over again. But the fights never ended. I ended up losing my job. Um, I then eventually had another job and then I lost that job as well. And that, due to that, losing that job, I ended up having more problems in my marriage um, fi for financial reasons. So I felt worthless. I felt like I couldn't do anything right. Um, I felt sad, the depression was just getting worse and worse. I always um, was known as a happy person. People used to always tell me all the time that I must have a really good life because I was always smiling. I was always kind of masking what I really felt and I didn't like for people to ask me what I was going through because I, I, I didn't want to talk about it. I didn't want to talk about what I was going through to anybody. I just wanted to keep that to myself and just cry really because I didn't feel like anybody had the answer for me. The first day that I came to the Universal Church, it was on a Friday. Um, it was the day of liberation. So the pastor actually came up to me through um, during the liberation prayer and he prayed for me and every single thing he prayed for was exactly what I was feeling. So I remember I just cried and cried and cried a lot. That was like my moment of venting at that point. I I mean, it was just a cry that I couldn't stop because he knew, it's, it's as if he knew what I was going through. On the first day that I came to the church, I felt peace, I felt light, I felt like a weight had been lifted off my shoulder. I began going Mondays um, to seek for fi my financial life, uh, Wednesdays to seek for myself because I really needed to take that depression out. I started going Fridays so that I could get liberated from all the problems I was having and then I would go Sundays just pray for everything that was going on in my life and I began doing that for several months. I overcame depression um, little by little. I just kept coming to church. I was seeking of God more 
and everything started getting better. I was feeling peace inside of me. Now I'm actually a physical therapist. I have a career. Um, everything just started going up from there. I didn't have a house at the time. I always lived um, with family members and now I have my own house. I drive a Mercedes. Um, everything has just gotten so much better. Regardless, you know, of the trials and tribulations that I face every day, I'm always happy, I'm always at peace because I know where God took me out from. I know that He's always there to help me overcome the problems. And I'm always happy.